Hey guys, so it is uh, the eclipse day and I've been getting a lot of messages about keeping my boys in but as you can see I have a huge tree. There's the sun right there and during the whole time this is going to be going on my tree is going to cover the sun. As you can see all the shade here. My boys will be perfectly fine. So and I don't think in Michigan we're even going to notice anything. <laughs> so I think they'll be fine. And most of the time when they're outside, their noses are to the ground. They're not looking up in the sky. Unless there was a squirrel in here. But like I said, this tree blocks. There it is right there. You can barely see it right there. So my boys will be good. Right? Now we got to take Miggy and Mozzie and Marley to the vet to get their um booster shot for the Lyme vaccination so and Magnum is doing good um I'm gonna ask him today because I didn't go to the vet when my husband took him um when he was having his reaction and see if it maybe the booster shot has something else in it maybe that's what he had the reaction to maybe it was him getting the booster shot plus the uh lepto distemper um maybe it was them together I'm gonna kind of ask him what they think because he had the lepto distemper shot before and he didn't have a reaction. So maybe it was both of them together or something in the booster shot for the Lyme vaccination. I don't know. But, I mean, it wasn't a horrible, it wasn't life-threatening reaction, but um, he still had a reaction. So, what are you doing? It's hot out. Look at him. He's panting. He's panting. Let's see. Are you hot, uh, Magnum? Are you hot? Okay, so gotta get them ready. Wash their faces, and I gotta brush them and take off. just got done at the vet my husband's in um, paying the bill everybody got their booster for their Lyme uh, vaccination and they listened to all their hearts and stuff and Mozzie she said she could barely just in the right spot hear what she thought might be a heart murmur so of course my heart dropped because I don't know anything about it so he's got to go back in Sorry if you can hear my air conditioning. I apologize if it's hot. Um, I've got to take him back in a month to see if it sounds louder or if it's still the same. She said it could be something he was born with and just no one's ever heard it because she said I, she had to have it just in the right spot to even barely hear anything. So, of course, now I'm going to have anxiety over this. But, so if anybody had a dog with a heart murmur please leave me comments and let me know uh, what to expect she said there's medication um, he might have to see a cardiologist I don't know how much that'll cost um, so if anybody's had experience with a dog with a heart murmur just leave me some comments or messages um, let me know how your experience went how your dogs were but yeah so but everybody got their booster shot, right, Marley? Yeah? <laughs> and they're ready to go home. Just waiting for Dad to pay you the bill. Okay, so we're back from the vet. Miggy wants to play ball. And we did not have much of an eclipse here. <laughs> we didn't, it didn't, I mean, 
Everybody's saying, oh, I think it's getting a little dark, but I think it was the clouds. <laughs> so everybody survived the eclipse. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Pray for Mozzie that he don't have a heart murmur. I'm hoping we take him and um, she was just hearing things maybe. <laughs> so everybody get, say a little prayer for him. He don't have a heart murmur. I know it's not the end of the world, but we all want our dogs to be healthy and uh, happy. Bye.